y'all hey how y'all doing hope everybody's feeling good and great you know i know it's jet um bitch you don't know man bitch uh-uh who been the places i've been fuck like five four five six best friends but you don't know that bitch uh-uh and you don't know that bitch because that bitch that bitch definitely ain't me shout out to train because that's all it was to be the jail but anyway y'all know how i do i just jump right into it um and today is sex <laughs> tip <laughs> tuesday bitch sex <laughs> tip Tuesday, bitch. So, look, y'all know how I do it. I just jump right into it. I'm so sexy. Look, ladies, now with stockings, stock, stockings can be very sexy, right? Uh, fishnet stockings. Get you a pair of fishnet stockings. And here's my tip to that. And this is about dressing sexy and, and sensual. And that, how you don't need that necessarily spend a lot of money. Just follow along. Fishnet stockings. You can either have the ones that have the opening, right? And with the opening, you don't necessarily have to have on panties. Or you can have on a G-string or whatever type of pretty panties that you want to have on underneath, right? More likely to stock, let's say that they're black. Um, and some heels, Right, you have to have on you some nice stripper heels. The reason why stripper heels are really, really good is because you your foot is leveled. You're not so like you're not flat and then like that. Like this, that shit is so uncomfortable. I don't give a fuck what's that big heel or how much money you spent on it. Bitch, them shits motherfucking hurt. Okay, so the stripper heels is is a great fam. Don't be scared of them, but you know you just gotta learn how to walk in them, which I'll teach you. Have on some of those and a black bra. And boom, there it is. You, you, oh, wait. You can also change your hair. Not only that. Put on the wig. If you wear your hair whatever type of way, and you, like, you can find you a wig, get you a different type of wig. Put put this wig on. You like a totally different person. Maybe you wear red lipstick, or maybe you don't wear lipstick on a regular. Put on you some lipstick. You can go black. You can go red. You can go pink. Whatever. If you want to get crazy with your eyes, you know, like do it like a, a wing tip. You can also do it. See, this is nice, simple, sexy. You can be, or you come home and just have that on and sitting on the bed. Or in the kitchen cooking his meal with this on. Like you cooking it. You got the fishnets, the stripper heels, a bra. All this is black. Uh, wig, lipstick, wing tip eyes. That's it. And, you know, honey, you ready. So that's the tip for the day, bitches. Try that shit out. And y'all bet everybody has that in their fucking closet. If you don't, you can easily go get you a pair. I don't know. I got a lot of fucking uh, fishnets. Fishnets. Super Hills, you know I got those. Uh, panties or no. Or no. Black bra. So like like a nice black pretty black bra or pink or white. You can you you can you can switch up wig. I also got a wig on my website. I got the shoes also on my website you can purchase. Um and, and lipstick and you can do a wig tip you know, with the black eyeliner. He wait you cooking. He coming home. You making his you making his meal and you serve him with that on. Or you can, or maybe you ain't cooking. Maybe you ready to fuck right now. As soon as he come in, you you sitting there like this, ah, dressed like that. Ah. He gonna take that dick out so quick, put that shit in your motherfucking mouth. So that's my sex tip for that today, ladies. Y'all try that shit out. Anyway, y'all know my name is Real, and I'm an intimacy coach slash seductress with the service called Seductive Art. And on June 25th, I will be teaching ESS, an erotic, sensual, and seductive dance. It's in the spirit of Juneteenth. We're going to be celebrating women's sexuality and our femininity um, with ESS. You have to bring heels and also sneakers. We're going to do sexy stretches. We're going to work out. We're going. I'm going to teach you how to walk in heels with technique and confidence. And we're going to dance with soft, subtle movements. 
erotic, sensual, and seductive movements. To where you learn how to captivate him. To where the you done, you done, you, when you perform with him, he just he gonna want to grab you and suck and lick and 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 kiss and rub and tap and spank, flip you over and kiss and touch and love and caress and suck and lick and uh rub and flip you back over and suck and lick and rub and 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 finger and uh kiss and uh tie you up all this shit. And sex gonna be good, good. So y'all make sure y'all try that shit out. So yeah, so then we gonna learn that, right? At my so y'all go to my website, which is seductive-art.com, and get all the information. I hope to see y'all there. Not only is it um in person, you can also join virtually, but just make sure you're in a private room. Make sure that door is closed because my mouth is hella filthy. Y'all already know how I get down. Um and y'all know I'm an author. The title of my book is called Quickie and Seven Shorty Black Stories. Read why you fuck, fuck, why you read. You already know what the time it is. I'm also a designer slash fashion architect. The name of my brand is Real Nice by Real. Um, I will be having some things coming up really, really soon. Um, I appreciate that. Try to get the numbers up around here. If I resonate with you, you know what to do. Uh, and you know how we need this motherfucker. Be kind, be gracious, be on time, be focused, be about your motherfucking money. Be normal and some fake ass motherfuckers around you. Get rid of them immediately. Be polite, be kind, be loving, be great at what you're great at. Be confident, be sexy, be boisterous, be opinionated, be on time. Black people be black and proud. Be a part of your community. Uh, be great at what you're great at. Be all these great things. You know, all we doing around here is pushing P. And when I say we pushing P, we pushing positivity. So with that, um, we're, we're pushing positivity. Um, the one thing that you don't do or fold or turn or switch, and that is you always be you. Until we meet again, y'all have a great one. Peace.